morning, good afternoon. Uh, my name is Henry. I'm the training manager of Taylor's International Hotel. So today our training will cover difference between the similar functions in your cross system. So before we start, so could you please introduce yourself? My name is Lucia. I'm from Indonesia and I've been working here for um, two weeks. Oh, two weeks. So means you just join Find any 
the message or the delivery, there's a dispersion. You see? You just choose one very close one. Then you just add on some description for the specific information. Okay, let's pick an example. Let's say I want to inform front office. Let's say I want to inform them when the guest check in. You just remember to click click the billing later. So I just choose billing later, click billing later, then area, check in. In area, we all have three options check in, check out, or reservation. This, this is three different type of area. So we actually click OK. Then when the guest check in or come to the counter, when the front office start open the guest profile, you see, this one will pop up. Automatically, yes. Uh, this one will pop up, inform the staff to collect the video data. Once, uh, once this alert done, the staff will delete the alarm. Means that one finished. This one, this, I already, means the staff already had the video data. Okay. And Okay, for traces, say you go to option, you choose traces, then you will go come to this screen. This screen is easy to understand at the day, from which day to which day, and the time, the department code. The department code is each department code, housekeeping, run office, reservation, and that. You just choose which department you want to inform. Let's say I want to inform housekeeping. The guest say, I will leave my room at uh, 8 o'clock. You can come to clean my room at eight, after 8 o'clock. Okay, so I send the traces to housekeeping. Please clean the guest room after 8 o'clock at 8 o'clock. The date is 20 of April. That's a guest request. Okay, so this is traces. So each department, when the morning shift start coming, first, our job is to check the traces for this thing. Okay, let's say front office start when the morning check start come, they will open front desk traces, then they will see this. This is a list for the traces for front office. They need to solve the problem of what they, they need to do. Okay, they will have one staff or two staff, they will specially to do the traces, solve the traces. Okay, so, okay, this is for Jesus. Any question? Yes, I already know Call is let's say we need to request the guest room number 
let's say the guest number is 909. Okay, you see, I want to set up a wake up call for one day only. Then the time is I want to set one wake up call at 6, another follow up wake up call at 6 30, in case I cannot wake up at 6. Okay, so we just set up key and information. Room number 909, time 6 and 6 30. They only request for one day, so I just step, I just key in one day. So you can follow up call time, you uh, you can follow up call two times? Yeah. Follow up call is in case the first wake up call didn't wake up. So I'm not one. This one? Yes. Okay. So, any questions? Or we can only call them to operate the... This one depends on the hotel. In our hotel, we just record this one. We have operation center. Later, the operation center, we will, we will set up one like program or system. They will call to the guest room automatically. So it's not really like no, you call. Yeah. How about if like um, if the guest stay for one week, but the wake up call time every day is different. So the guest request which I call one day, six a.m. Tuesday seven, and then we go back to. So we just set up separately, so each one, each so one. one by one, yeah. yeah, one by one. Okay, one day and then you one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, just make sure you know they down every week. Okay. So don't miss anyone because we get to do this. Okay. So uh, one more thing, if let's say our wake up call in our hotel, I don't know other hotel, in our hotel, let's say our wake up call didn't wake up the guest. We no need to go to the guest room, knock the door, say, sir, please wake up, it's already 6 o'clock. No need. We already, when the guest set up the wake up call, we already informed him or her. If the wake up call didn't wake you up, we don't have any responsibility. We already informed the guest. So no need to go to the guest room to inform them. Okay? This is our wake up call annotators. So we move on. For the add-on and shares, I think this one is more difficult. A little more difficult. So for add-on, it's a guest request one more room register under the same name. Okay, let's say I'm staying in your hotel and you already check in. So suddenly tomorrow my friend call. Tomorrow I will drop back to, to stay with you because my room is small or I don't want to share the room so it's my best friend so I want to one more room for him. I don't want him to pay. So I just approach from office and say, uh, can I have one more room for my guest but registration under my name. So the same all the payment under to me. Okay, so this time um, easy for our stuff. So we have add on. So add on is just click add on. So the same information will pop up. You just choose the room type, then we'll create a new room but under the same name. Okay, so for shares is two or more guests who stay in one room but they want to separate the bed. Let's say two friends, two like best friends, they go to traveling, they stay in a hotel, they stay in one room, but they don't want one person to pay, they want to separate the bill. Let's say the room this bedroom one night is to buy something. So we can separate the bill, one person yeah, pay five hundred. Yeah. This is shares. Okay. okay, so for the set also quite easy. So for add-on, just click option, add-on, then we'll have this screen. Then you just according to the guest request, just choose choose the room type. Elastic pin or elastic pin or square pin. Then just click OK. Then a new room will create, but under the same name. So the address just click on the same Yeah, no need to. So for shares, also option, shares will have this screen. Yeah, have this one. This is the information about the, this, this room status. Let's see the guest 
stay for four nights. Okay, the room payment is six hundred. Something like that. This one is an example. Stay for six hundred. So you just click come back. Then the system will ask you, do you want to copy payment details? Yes. Because the guests want to separate the bill, right? So we need to copy the payment details. Okay, we just click yes. Then they will ask you what's the name, who you want to serve, share with. So just click, you just key in all the information. Let's say uh, Mr. Chan wants to share with Ms. Ella. Okay, so we just key in the name, Ella. Then we click, key in all the information, we click OK. So we are like this. For example, the room original stay for one net is 1,200. After we we create the shares, each person will pay 600. Each is the charge. Yeah. So we don't need to calculate one room 1,200 blah 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 like that. Okay. This one will separate automatically. Also the bill we will print out is also separate. Okay. Then okay. see. That's it. Do you have any more questions? So share is one staying in two staying in one room and wants to separate the bill. Mm, yes. And if at all it's like they add one more room but they want it to be charged in their account. Mm. I mean I, I stay in one room, then I book another room for my friend but I want to pay. Uh, add-on is quite like we only create the same profile mm. under the same name. So for the payment, if the person say I want to pay also for my friend room, then we will do login. Login mm. I will teach you the next next training. Okay. That one is um, really so it's good. It's like after uh, depends on the guest mm. request. Because I add-on is like I don't want my friend go to front office just say Okay, my name is blah 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 blah. Then I comment that I say uh, because the information is almost all same. Yeah. So you just create a new uh, profile, but and all I got my name, same information. Okay. So I got two questions for you to test how much you have need. So what is traces for? Traces is uh, when you go to inform other department about the requirements. Thank you.